Hello, I'm Emma Stackwitz, and I'm a student studying mechanical engineering at University of Illinois. Like many people, I've been trying to enrich my life by exploring new hobbies, such as gardening. Gardening makes you feel rewarded from doing very little work. All you have to do is water them, right? Well, if you've ever tried to keep a plant alive, you would have learned the hard way that not everyone has a natural green thumb. But why do plants die even if you water them the perfect amount? You see, plants require more care than just water, including specific fertilizer, humidity, and temperature. Despite knowing this, many people still struggle with plants due to being forgetful, busy, or even living in the wrong climate for their plants. Being a student, I've often overwatered my plants in preparation for visits home, only to return to dead plants and pests all around the house. To make plant care more streamlined, there are a variety of solutions, from self-watering pots to hydroponics. But none of these take care of every single component needed for a plant to thrive. For this reason, a product named the Auto Planter has been designed to create a plant environment that can be completely autonomous by combining the mechanisms of hydroponics with a greenhouse. The pot is composed of a water reservoir where liquid fertilizer can be added and injected into the soil to reach the set moisture level. The plants grow within a clear case, controlling humidity with the accompanying mister. The specifics of your plant can be set via the control panel and will even inform you if the water reservoir is low or if more fertilizer is needed. Pairing this with the built-in pest control, your plants can be left alone for weeks without any additional help. To pursue the creation of this product, a few things must be done. A lot of fabrication will go into this design, meaning contact with the manufacturer as well as material suppliers will need to be done. In addition to this, research must be conducted to create a proper liquid fertilizer to pair with the product, as it will be sprayed on the leaves and injected into the soil. After that, a patent will need to be filed and prototypes created. With all of this, the product can be ready for commercial use, making gardening more accessible to everyone worldwide.